my name is Molly M. My name is Harley S. I've been sober since April 22nd, 2010. November 23rd, 2007. Usually right when they get out of treatment, it's the scariest point in anybody's life. You're leaving this secure atmosphere where you know that everything's okay, you're safe, and as soon as you leave, you're kind of by yourself. And that's the best thing about this program is that we get to help them make the first transitions of when they leave treatment. Once I've been alerted that a new case has been added to my caseload, I then go to their face page, which is a page that includes all the information about them, their birthday, their sobriety date, when they're expected to discharge. I just have an opportunity to review who they are and where they're coming from. And the next step is getting an opportunity to talk with them face to face over a Skype call. Usually the calls, I start with kind of catching up with them, asking them how their week's been, what have they been up to, is anything different since the last time I talked to them. Then I'll ease into our questions and those will kind of gauge where they are in their recovery. Over the course of six months to eight months to a year, you know, talking to these guys 10, 15, 20, 30 minutes a time, twice a week, you get to know them. We've shared stories about ourselves, we laugh sometimes, we talk about all kinds of challenges and changes that they're going through, really get to be there for them for this really meaningful period of growth. We have staffing every day where we go over our cases specifically one by one and talk about how they're doing, what they're up to, if I have any challenges or need some advice or direction. Throughout the day, I will contact any number of individuals on my team who are all doing the exact same work I'm doing with their own caseloads. If I have a tough phone call, someone's really upset, if I need some guidance on any kind of a situation, I can always turn to my team. We share information, we talk about techniques and ways of handling different types of cases, different types of challenges that they present to us. It's an awesome experience being able to see someone who is leaving treatment that was hopeless, being able to get a job and become a functioning member of society again and seeing that the sky really is the limit and they can do whatever they put their mind to. Working with all of the guys I work with has been an amazing experience. To spend my time and my energy being of some service, of some assistance to people in this very, very you know, dramatic period of their life when ma major changes can be made. It's been a powerful experience.